Hi everyone, welcome to UC Airdrop. Somebody asked a question, so I decided to do this video so that it can help others who have similar question or challenge. His question is, how do I set slippage in my pancake swap exchange in Trust Wallet? How do I set slippage in my pancake swap exchange in Trust Wallet? Now remember what slippage is. I've done a video on this before explaining what slippage is. Slippage is uh, uh, simply uh, the, a particular token, the, the network uh, rate, the network rate or the network number decimal on which a particular token can be sold or swapped. Most tokens have their different slippage, but when you come into PancakeSwap 2, it has its own default um, slippage. So when you coin you are buying or selling, it's not using the default PancakeSwap slippage. It means that you have to set your own slippage differently. Okay, and to do that is very simple. So let me take you through how to do that. All right, so when you're in your Trust Wallet like this now, what you do that second button here, your D app, click on your D app. It will open. Scroll up. You see pancake swap. You click on pancake mm -hmm. swap. Just give that few seconds. It will load. Your pancake swap will load. Okay. When your pancake swap loads, you are going to have ability to change the slippage to whatever number you uh, want to change it to. Okay. This is my. Um, uh, this is my pancake swap exchange on Trust Wallet. So what I did. What you need to do now is. You come to this page where you see a swap where you see swap up here that is that is this place this place now swap here okay that is this sign this uh setting sign behind it beside it okay so we're going to click on that setting sign beside it now it will bring up a dialog box now this is it you see this is standard slippage is five which is a default slippage, but you want to change your own. For instance, in his own case, he wants to change his own to uh, seven, which is uh, what the coin he wants to sell or buy is on. So what we'll do now is, when you come in, you will see this place. This place, yeah, we have 17. It could be five, it could be anything, okay? Just tap on it, your keyboard pops up. Click back, tap on your delete button. If you tap on your delete button twice, the number you have there, for instance, 17 now might not clear it doesn't make any difference just type the number of slippage you want if it's for instance in his case he wants to set it to seven just type seven okay seven will enter here so this is the slippage now so what you know just need to do is you come come out where you have settings here right you see the star button right just cancel it it means that you have set your slippage now if you check this place you see slippage seven okay it means that you have set the slippage for whatever you want to buy to seven let's do it again from swap so on swap up here, right here, you click on the sign, the setting sign, then the slippage dashboard will open. Then you see, you see a space here. You click on inside this place, the, click on your back button as if you are deleting it. The number you have there may not go out, it does not matter. Put the number you want to set at the slippage. If it's 12, put 12. Okay. If it's if it's 10, put 10. Now, somebody may say, how do I know the slippage of a coin I want to buy? Usually, you can ask in the Telegram group of that uh, that particular token. If you ask in the Telegram group, they will be able to tell you if what you are buying, the, the slippage of the uh, token you are buying. Most new tokens have their different uh, slippage, so you just have to find out which is which, so you don't make mistakes, all right? So, this is how to set slippage on your um, on your pancake swap in your trust wallet so you'll be able to do your swappings and all that so in this place now you can do from here now you can continue you can put the uh from your bnb here you can i put the uh, the coin you want to buy here so this is just how to set slippage on pancake swap okay it's very easy uh, it's very simple to use if you have any question based on this just let me know okay all right thank you very much and do have a blessed day bye